Hey everyone, welcome back to World of Final Fantasy. Uh, as you can see, I'm in the tea room and we got two additional intervention quests. Uh, in addition, I also purchased Refia's Champion Medal. Got that equipped, so when the time comes, I can show that off. Also, just to note, I messed around with the configurations, upped everyone's audio, and lowered the music just a little bit. I think that'll be beneficial for everything here on out. Otherwise, I'm just gonna get to it. I guess there's no point in me dwelling on it now. Seriously, getting to town and back is a real pain in the neck. Maybe with some magic, I wonder if I could just build an ice bridge right here. <laughs> oh yeah, I guess I don't know how to use uh, blizzard magic. <laughs> Build a bridge? Uh, I suppose that it would ease the journey to town, but ice sounds like a recipe for a broken neck. You might have a point there. Hmm, a bridge of ice. Oh, now hold on. I've heard of a mirage who might be able to make us exactly what we're looking for. That would be great! I think her name was Shiva. She's said to live somewhere in Cornelia. Hmm... It, wait a second. If we build a bridge that leads right to town, then who's going to stay at the Solace anymore? Hmm... I certainly can't have that. D hey, Revia! We weren't done talking this over yet! Good grief. How'd I let you talk me into coming along? That's funny, I thought I told you I could handle it myself. Hey! Where's Shiva? Get out here on the double so we can discuss some business! <sighs> <laughs> you want me to come to you? How about I turn you to ice and hang you up on my wall? Ugh. No thank you. Unless you're hiding some handsome men, then I'm done with you now. Goodbye. We never said we're done with you. So, we were hoping to ask for a favor. A favor? Hmm... A bridge of ice? Yes! We heard that you were a specialist of sorts. You must be mistaken. I'm not the one who does the ice bridge trick. Oh, out of your league? Well, we won't waste our time with second-tier mirages. You ready to go, Raffia? Huh? Whoa, 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 wait, wait, just a minute! When did I say that I can't do it? I heard what you said. But bridges are the other Shiva's job. If you're too small time, then just say so. I do not talk like that at all. And you dare to call me small time? You wretched human! Everyone calm down! Come on now, you're the great Shiva. Maybe you ought to keep your cool. Go on, just build the bridge for him. Oh, and for us, too. Wait, what? When did you two show up? What's going on? I guess you might say that we're kind of sort of tagging in. You're... what? That doesn't even begin to make any sense. But don't expect any mercy from me. <laughs> this time, I'll show you I'm not whatever it is you thought I was. Are you still hung up on what she said in the nebula? Wow, Blond remembers that conversation? I guess it did traumatize him. He'll always be wonder what we were talking about. Hey, I'll get over it. Someday. Speaking of the nebula, we got Shiva back here. Had you chosen to fight her, I think this battle is pretty identical. But regardless, <laughs> um, not really too much of a challenge. This is a pretty simple battle where you're just going up against Shiva. And you're just like welling on her, and he'll win, and you get rewarded. Oh, she's got the dust. All right, diamond super dust. epic du uh, diamond dust. Here we go with the snap. If I remember correctly, that that is something that Final Fantasy X introduced, but it's it's very elegant. I like it. And that, I mean, there's really not a whole lot to comment. Just do it, get rewarded, and then we're moving on to the next one. Um, yeah. Everybody, that was Shiva. Why, well, it could have been like if you battled her in the nebula. 
<laughs> I didn't. I chose Z for. Ugh, forget it. Have it your way. I'll build you your stupid ice bridge. Happy? Huh? Oh, thank you so much. Now the trip to Seronia won't take nearly as much time. It sure won't. Wait! This is exactly the kind of shortcut to bankruptcy that I was trying to avoid! No, I must... I must destroy the bridge! Relax, Jarlotta. It'll be okay. <laughs> oh no! Sherlock's gonna go broke! She's gonna lose the inn! <laughs> Not my problem! <laughs> but I did like that cutscene. That was a good cutscene. Although I have to say, with Shiva, you figured she'd actually make a nice ice bridge, kind of something you see from Frozen, Shall but nope. Started? Just an ugly yeah, yeah. slab of ice connecting from one, point so A to point touch. B. Well, I guess it does the job. It seems pretty shoddy if you ask me. Oh yeah, don't forget to collect a reward, and without further ado, next quest, just keep bringing them on. Okay, Charlotta. This is the place we heard about. Mm -hmm. It is f -f -f freezing out here. Let's get this over with so I can go back to the inn. Right. Somehow, I don't think she'll keep us waiting long. Leave it. Leave it. <gasps> D did you hear that? She's here. Leave your gill and treasure and be gone from this place if the undead princess is royalty she must be the rich uh well i guess it's possible no who else must be the wealthy that skeleton yeah. the mirage lich what oh i get it lich rich <laughs> well too bad princess i don't have a gill to my name and you're bragging well Technically, you don't let him be near any of the money, so he's actually telling the truth. I like this battle. Straightforward, to the point. Here we are battling the undead princess. Okay, first off, she's got a little bit of challenge to her. You know, she slows us down. That's that's problematic. So, go on the hourglass, everybody. Other than that, I mean, it's pretty straightforward. Just attacks us. I think she has death, but, you know, regardless, I'll deal with that when the time comes. Otherwise, let's give Chaz some showcase. Let's let him use his chocobo kick double hit ability. You know what I'm saying? It's epic. As for Spider Mikey, let's give him a little showcase. Let's use the almighty knife. Something Tom Bears are known for. Oh yeah, look at that. Epic charge and stab! Shanked ya! <laughs> nice damage, I must say. Oh, Spider Mikey, beautiful, beautiful. I think he'd be proud of that. I think both Chaz and Spider Mikey, they'd be proud of what they can do in this battle. And any battle. Also, why don't we show off Refia? Probably be a good thing to do. Are you two okay? I'm here to help. Healing light! Now, I admit, a little bit of a waste. It's a support ability. It heals you, and then I think it also removes some negative status effect. You know what? Not important. Not important. Point is, I could have used that in the last battle. Would have been more beneficial. But regardless, that's, that's it. Also, her theme is a remix of the Final well, Fantasy battle theme. It. Final Fantasy 3 battle theme. Yeah. Anyways. So, yeah. Undead Princess did it. Victory. We won. Spire Mikey leveled up. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay, okay. Just lay off of me. Wow, you're the strongest mortals I've ever seen. I don't suppose such tough gals would be willing to. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Do you think she was trying to tell us something there? Maybe. As long as she's not bothering this place anymore. Let's go home. Stop right there! Are you just naturally mean? Because I was all like, don't kill me, let's talk. Don't pretend you didn't hear me. Was I supposed to spare you so you'd stab me in the back? And why are you still breathing? Can't you take a hint? Let's try this again. Ah! I am so not breathing! Check it out! Dead as a doornail! Oh, I'm undead. The problem is I can't let creepy she-monsters scare folks away from my inn because that would basically put me out of business. <laughs> Shall we, Refia? Uh, remind me never to get on your naughty list. Look who you can't kill. What is it going to take? Charlotta, I don't think we're going to make much progress this way. Maybe we should hear what she has to say. You're way too nice for your own good. Now talk. And it better be worth it if you don't want a beating. Why are you so violent? Look, just for the record, I'm not doing this because it was my choice. Come on, being a mirage leaves me with so much time to kill. So I said fine, what the hey? May as well make a little bling bling off my hobby. So you're tormenting people just because you're bored? Ow! Please don't hurt me! I'm just trying to give you some context. If a lady has a better idea, then hey, I'm all ears! So what you're saying is you don't know what to do with your unlife. Yeah, super lame, I know. I mean, all I've really got is this deep-seated grudge, which is great for my hex life. But sometimes the magic just isn't there, even though it's supposed to be. <sighs> all right, I get it. If I can't slay you, I may as well make you useful. Whoa, for real? From now on, instead of scaring adventures away from my inn, I want you to scare them towards it. If you can do that, you're hired. Cool! You really mean it? Yes, I'll do it! I'm on the job! And don't you go threatening them or stealing their valuables. Oh, I would never dream of it, mistress! Ooh, I have a purpose! Something to live for at long last! You just got through telling us you're dead. Well, that should take care of that. Refia, we're leaving. Oh, right! Hey, wait, mistress! I'm going with you! Nope, your job is right here, 24-7. Wha- Is that, like, even legal? Oh, welcome to the real world of employment. You're gonna be wondering if, like, what you're doing is even legal. Cause, I mean, shit, man. Work welcome sucks sometimes. I digress, yeah. you know. My own lament aside, I did a job, I should get rewarded. You know, pay me. Oh, hey, I got a new mission. Uh, I guess I should go do that. But before that, I gotta get my shit. I got an undead memento. That's pretty cool, because uh, now I can evolve something into that. Except I don't have the mirage, so I guess it's all irrelevant. Also, I don't have any armor gems, so I can't do the next mission. That sucks. But regardless, I guess we can advance the plot, because I got a little bit of time, and I wouldn't mind getting things moving along, you know, make this a little relevant. But before that, I gotta check Seraphie's head, because, I mean, yeah. looks like she has something amazing. She's got a mover, and that increases everyone's SP by one, and let's be honest, having everyone increase their SP, very beneficial. You want them to increase their SP. Artificially or by leveling them up. I mean, it's, it's all useful. It's very nice. I digress. I'm going to go to Seronia Harbor. And through some editing magic, we're going to Seronia Harbor. I did not mess up. See, we're here. So, yeah, I guess it's time to go talk to these fellows. These guys. Advanced plot. Did you hear? There's a real pirate ship in the harbor. It's so cool. Ah, oh, pirate ship. That brings back some memories. Heading for the low seas? That's completely insane. I can't lend you a boat, but I'm rooting for you. You're no help at all. What are you gonna do? Say, woo! You go, guys. Find that boat. What's that? You want me to lend you my boat? But if I did that, I wouldn't be able to go fishing. At this rate, we might as well swim to the low seas. Well, you can't really blame them. They probably need every boat they've got to make ends meet. Wait, 
Hold your chocobos. Didn't somebody mention a pirate ship was parked at the pier? Yeah, something like that. Why? What's your point? <laughs> I've got an idea. What if we beat up all the pirates and then commodore their ship? What? There's no way it'll be that easy. Well, we don't have to go in with Mirage's blazing. We might just be able to sneak off with it. They're pirates, right? Who's gonna file a complaint? I guess. It's definitely risky, but if we don't get our butts in gear, Refia's not uncle, or that freak in the creepy golden mask might come along and really rain on our parade. Lesser of two evils it is. Docs, here we come. Oh, I get to go take over a pirate ship. I haven't seen that except in Final Fantasy 1 and 5. And uh, insert third thing here. I don't know if there is another example. You know what? Not important. Point is, next time, we're taking over a pirate ship and we're going to be pirates. Because that's how it works.